Hi guys, how are you doing? Uh, this is Ramiz here. I'm a Pakistani British and I'm speaking to you from a YouTube channel. So I just have come with another interesting vlog. Uh, so let me tell you about my this week earning. I was able to make from uh, Monday to Saturday 851 pound with Uber and uh, I did 335 pounds with old so which makes all together 1186 pounds and uh, today is the Sunday of Sunday and I'll take rest sleep well probably in like five to six hours after I plan to go to work again and I'm pretty sure I'll carry more like 150 to 200 pounds more so if I let's say add 150 pound to my 1186 of amount so it should rise till 1350 let's say maximum i'll be able to make 1400 pounds this week so yeah i'll just i have just made a screen recording of my earnings like from uber app and uh, from the bolt app so you guys can watch it now welcome back so yeah today's vlog is gonna be interesting again uh, especially for those people who requested that to make the vlog about uh, rental cars uh, let's say some newbies they have just got their private hire license and they wanted to start it with uber and bolt or any other cab service so they are planning to buy if, if let's say they are plan planning to buy the car on rent so first of all i recommend you that somehow if you guys can manage to buy your own car you should do it because you have already decided that you have to do this job and uh, i'm pretty sure um, you will you guys will like like to do it when you will have more earnings with you all right so if you guys can manage it to buy your own car even you buy it for ten thousand pound twelve thousand pounds worth of car just buy it but if you can't do it let's say so many people have economics issues and they or some are just thinking that uh, they should rent a car and see how it goes and then then they decide after a couple of months if they have to keep renting the car or if they have to buy another car so these situations are different and uh, it's up to you guys however you want it and uh, yeah for now i'll just discuss that let's say uh, you have go uh, you have got your private hire license and now you rent a car yeah so i'll after the uh, this videos uh, will finish i'll put the screen recording of uh, the rent to buy or rental cars which is being offered to me uh, by uber basically i had the clean air assistance i was doing the uber uh, rides and uh, for every ride i was uh, like paying over 30 pence probably 20 30 pence for every ride uh, to for the for the you know the clean air assistance so this um, this amount they had it with them so after let's say 3000 4000 trips uh, i i was able to make nearly 1500 pounds and uber has this money and now they are offering me that i could uh, rent a car or rent to buy electric car and uh, yeah so after the after this video you guys can see whatever offers they they are giving me and you can have idea idea that uh, what uber is offering to the drivers to help them to buy or to rent the electric cars okay so yeah watch it now
welcome back. Uh, so now you guys have idea that how Uber is helping the drivers to get electric vehicle either on rent or either on rent to buy schemes. In general, I can tell you that uh, uh, if you even rent a car or if you even rent to buy a car, you have to spend like 1100 pound to 1300 pound a month and then you can get car with these companies which are V-Flex, Auto or Breathe Cars. Okay. But there is another option also for you guys. Like if you look for the local dealers, uh, like uh, with the reference of you, any friend, or you can even see so many ads on the internet that even the local dealers are giving the cars on on rent, like weekly rent, and that is roughly 80, 90 pound to 120 pound a week. And uh, you pay this much rent to to these local dealers, and you can pay the insurance by yourself so you could even uh, choose that way okay and i recommend you like you can uh, don't put yourself in the longer terms like longer contracts four to five year of contract in the beginning just get the car for a couple of months like two month three month and uh, just rent the car you know on, on short terms like on some weeks of notice just get the car and uh, in those weeks or in the beginning you can decide either you have to keep renting the car or you can even buy your own car or what you have to do either you have to do this job or either you can't do it so in the beginning it's uh, I know it's a bit difficult decision to take however uh, this is a good idea that you rent the car in the beginning and decide in two three months either you you have to uh, buy the car or you have to keep renting the car okay or either you have you just you just leave the job you don't want to do it so these are the decisions you have to take in a couple of weeks okay so for from me good luck guys okay i wish you best of luck and uh, i can tell you that uh, this private hire uh, you know the driver job private hire driver job is uh, just so ideal okay you guys can work anytime you want and uh, there are so many flexibilities and also earning is higher as well so I recommend you guys that whoever the newbies feel motivated and uh, come into this job, you will be uh, uh, very much, you know, appreciating uh, the things you get in life. All right. So from me, good luck. If you like the video, hit like button and subscribe to the channel so that I can ke keep updating about myself. And as well, if uh, I have so much, so much experience and I can keep sharing a lot of things with you guys. Okay. Even to help you that uh, how you can make a better money okay even you can see my past vlogs i have uh, made the made the videos to help newbies thank you so much guys if you like the video just hit the like button so that a lot of people can see this video and uh, please subscribe to the channel thank you so much guys thank you have a lovely day bye bye